It's really, it works really perfectly as well, because when you fight the boss you can't gain any more power, I guess. Yeah, a lot of the bosses spawn new monsters for you to fight, like especially the Act 2 boss. It, it spawns a few yeah. guys for you to play with. Yeah, and that's then you good, can get so you can survive. Yeah, I noticed that on the Act first Act 1 boss as well. I think like in Phase 2 it spawns some stuff, if I don't remember correctly. The Naga boss, uh, the Maiden or whatever she was called. Yeah, she spawns some monsters as yeah. she enters her second form. That's useful both for charges and also so that you can raise minions if you're a summoner. Yeah, oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, I know some people said the minions doesn't work flawlessly. I, I had a zombie, I tried it a bit. It seemed it seemed a little yeah. bit stupid, but I was thinking it's just a zombie, so they should be stupid. <laughs> Our next patch, that 0912, the one that introduces PvP, will also overhaul the minion stuff to make it a lot more fun. Like at the moment, it, it's not really, we're not happy with minions. We'll make them yeah. awesome. Yeah, I, I think they, is it like they need to be a bit more offensive maybe? Or. Well, at least the zombie, well, like, he didn't really attack stuff right away, he just stood around a bit. Right, it's partly because we haven't really done a proper pass over making sure they're balanced and fun for quite some time. So we're going to fix some obvious bugs with them, add some better UI. Okay, cool. Oh, I got level up. I, I really like the leveling system too, like, it's, every time you level, you're like, hmm. Like, there's always different things to choose. And, like, each Thanks. click kind of benefits your character a lot as well. So, you, you actually feel it every time you level, which is kind of nice. <clears throat> Here, I can show stream. This is the talent system. <laughs> I love showing this thing. Cause every time you, you show like, it off, everyone like... in chat goes crazy. Death yeah, free. Like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> here is my talent. I have like, a, making a little star here. Little star system. <laughs> 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 they wait for the chat. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> how, how many talents can you use per class, by the way? Uh, is there a cap? Uh, you get a, you get about a hundred points in total, okay. and you can go wherever you want on the tree. Yeah, yeah, I, I heard it. Like I can go to the witch area if I want, would want to. Yes, if you want to make a custom or order, sure. Oh yeah, I, I can. I, but no, I think. I, I, I don't, I've never understood that, like, in a lot of games, people, like, it's like, make, they make, like, let's say they make a warrior, but they make, they make it into a support warrior, why not pick a support class instead, I've never understood that, like, if you yeah, play, well. well, I guess some people like to mess around a bit, but, uh, I, I guess it's just me who likes going the optimal way, usually, like, sure. some type of optimal way. Put it this way, when they eventually find a good build for some reason, like there's a clever combo, then it becomes the optimal way. Yeah, yeah it could definitely be that. And you, there's some really crazy builds that come up. Yeah. yeah, the best thing about this system is that I don't think anyone will ever have the same spec in this game. <laughs> yeah. Well, it is it is hard to copy someone. Yeah. I mean, in Diablo 3, you could easily respect to be identical to someone, and then you RMAH the same items that they had. Yeah. Whereas in our game, for starters, you can't respec very easily, so you've got to start a new guy. And secondly, you have to like level up using the skills that you're eventually choosing. So if it's yeah. a kind of really endgame only build, then it's quite hard to level that yeah. character up. And finally, getting the items requires a lot of trading and a lot of time. Exactly. You can't just RMAH them. Yeah, if some guy has and a full so set of six slots, I mean, having identical like, colors like that guy would almost be impossible, I guess. Or would require yeah. a shit loads of time. Well, I mean, our best players can achieve pretty complex builds, yeah. you know, and they can copy each other's builds if they put effort in. But that requires quite a lot of mastery, you know, it doesn't yeah. just require a credit card. But I don't think they will ever, like, it's kind of hard to make an optimal build with this many skills and mm. talents. Like, yeah. like in the other 3, there isn't really that much abilities, like, so it's kind of easy to make something optimal. Like, I Fair think enough. people would find a lot of like hidden builds here and maybe not share them with everyone right away. They wanna yeah. abuse them a while well, for everyone. That's up to them. Tries to copy. We're them. making we're making sure that inspecting characters is something that's optional, so that when oh, really? you have an awesome PvP build, you can turn it off if you don't want Ooh. people to see what your build. Oh, is. I like that a lot. Even though I stream, so I'm fucked, but <laughs> it's still really good. I can hide my window every time I open my inventory later, my secret build. Nice. <laughs> I 
Jonathan, that user on the forum of sure says that he's going to buy an expensive pack if we add turtle pets. He was saying so before, and we're going to hold him to it. <coughs> we started work on turtles already, man. It's this whole great demand about it. With regard to the users that are asking about respecking, basically you can respec very limited amounts using some quest rewards and some items that you can find rarely. And the goal here is to fix mistakes and correct small problems with your build. But if you actually want to change your entire build, like you've been using uh, maces for 30 levels and you want to switch to swords, it's probably better to make a new character in that case. Yeah, I noticed, yeah. Like, I only have four respect points now. That means I can remove four abilities, I assume? Yes. Yeah. yeah, you really want to go on the right path. I don't know. It might be worth it to like, I don't know, maybe some super rare drop at high levels makes you be able to respect the whole tree. I don't know how you guys feel about it. Yeah, well there is a, there is a, or like one of the tradable items that lets you respect one point. And it's not that bad to trade for 50 of those. I mean, sure, it's a, it's a big time commitment. Yeah. But but they're, they're, I mean, you can do it if you're a player of lots of wealth. And for the no lifers okay. that are playing all day, that's not too bad for them to do. Like, okay. they can put in, you know, say. <laughs> Sorry, go on. Yeah, no, but let's say you're level 95 and it's taking like half a year to get there or something. Yeah, exactly. And then you might not want to make, make a new character to change your spec. Yeah. That's exactly what we were thinking. If you're level yeah. 30, it's easy to make another level 30 character in about exactly. four hours if you're really pro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, well, okay, so like a level 95 char character will be able to get enough gems to respect them. Yes. In fact, I've heard stories where the best players at the current drop rates can farm enough gems to fully respec in like 20 hours or something. Oh, and they're okay. getting other, they're getting other things at the same time, so that's really easy. Oh, there's, okay. there's more than 20 hours in one day, so... Yeah, well, that's, that's really good. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's Jonathan laughing there. Oh, well, that's good, that's good, that's good. In answer to the question from chat, the guy on Skype is Chris, the lead developer. Really? Was the... Oh, you're right, it does. They should read then. Sorry. Because even though I didn't <laughs> play a lot of Diablo 2, like my first characters had completely shitty builds and then I had to relevel them because there was no way to respec in the start. Like now there is though, I think. Yeah, they added those um, essences or whatever that I like, yeah, the token. Exactly. But they take quite a while to form, which is good. I mean, it shouldn't be easy to respect, but it should be yeah. possible, definitely. In answer to the question from chat, uh, how, how Jonathan's got it? Yeah, okay. <clears throat> this was actually a reskinned version of an Act 3 tile set. Yes. You know it's a ruined Tim? Oh, it's not really skin. Okay. It's a ruined version of an X3 tile set. Oh, these shields are good. Cedar tower shield. The guy asks how we met. Well all the really pro people just know each other, right? <laughs> um, we met because I received like 30 or 40 PM saying you need to go into this chat right now, this guy is awesome. Thank you guys. <laughs> How many people are watching now? I can't see the count of the viewers. Two, 